It's when somebody comes and whether they 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 want to choke you, whether they just grab your shirt. Right. Sometimes you're like, oh, I'm in this freeze moment. I don't know what to do. Right. So I have to get the kids to learn to respond quickly. Mm -hmm. You know, saying how to how to block. Right. Yeah. You know, <laughs> and then how to how to how to shock. Right. You know, like you block, but you got to deliver a blow. Right. And Count get out punch. of it. Right. right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, and uh, the kids. The fun thing about it is that a lot of dojos uh, around may not want kids with autism in their school because they could disrupt class. They may be their attention span may be shorter than than the normal kid, if you right. will. We welcome them at our school because I know how important it is that you know we have people in the community that means no good. They have autistic kids where the police rough them up and don't find out till later that they're wow. autistic. And sometimes these kids don't know how to respond right. fast enough. You might think that they're a little slower. But trying to show that these kids need to learn how to um, preserve themselves, preserve yeah. who they are. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think that's awesome. If, um, uh, if anyone wanted to get involved or anyone wanted to... Send a child uh, your yeah. way. Uh, is there information? Yeah, yeah. We're we're over on uh, four, uh, forty three thirty nine, Bowen Road. We're in Southeast, yes, and sir. we welcome, we welcome all children to come on out. Not just ch children with autism, right. but uh, all children. Yes. Uh, we take kids as young as six years old. Uh, we have uh, a few kids that are, are testing for black belt next year. Oh, awesome, man. Black wow. belt. Wow. You see what I'm saying? Teenagers, wow. and they're off the street. They're yes. with us. They move through the ranks, and now they're becoming black belt. So we're excited about that. We have kids who compete. Mm -hmm. uh, we had three kids who competed in a national tournament. Wow. Came back with hardware. You know oh, what I'm saying? Congratulations. Go, yeah, yeah, going in the local tournaments. Um, it's all about practice performance and promotion mm. and the documentary can be found on uh tubi i'm really excited about congratulations that. man tubi, uh, tubi tubi's open to because they yeah. dash you like all oh, my stuff on tubi yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> man, hey tubi has opened up a way and it's passing netflix because it has wow. a it has a model that netflix doesn't so netflix is now having its challenges while Tubi is on the rise. Right, right, yeah. So any artist out there who's doing content, consider Tubi. Uh, another place you can see it is on Amazon Prime. Uh, right, you right. Know, you have to pay for it on Amazon Prime, so, you know, there are people who just love Amazon. Right, You know right. what I'm saying? So they watch everything on Amazon. <laughs> if it makes Amazon, Amazon is the standard. Mm -hmm. So if it makes Amazon, you know, I want people to be able to go there and see it. It's a, it's a short it's a small cost to rent or or to purchase but for those who can if you go to on Tubi you can watch it for free yeah. you know the way the way that they they pay out is through their advertisement so they mm -hmm. share that's they a good share business with module. Them. It, it's yeah. it's amazing yeah that's a great business module yeah. and so uh, the name of the documentary yes it, it's called I am a martial artist yeah. I am a martial artist a u t i s t mm. Y'all see that? Y'all see what he did there? <laughs> and y'all don't know what y'all dealing with here. Yeah. This guy writes books. Yes. Movies. Yes. And teaches martial arts. So if yes. you talk shit about his movie, <laughs> you might get a chop. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah. And there's a book, too. On Amazon, you can find the film, but also with the same title, I'm a Martial Artist. There's a book. And in my book, I highlight the importance of the benefits of martial arts yes. for kids with autism. Awesome. And this, to me, I, I say it's dope, not because I, I was the one who wrote it, I say it's dope because it's about black children. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And yes, sir. I, you don't want to keep getting, feel like you can't say it, but it's no, we, about we, we black We can say it. We yeah. can say it. <laughs> That's why I do what I do. That's what I started the media. We, we telling black and brown stories. That's right. We telling our stories. That's so, right. Unapologetically. Unapologetically. You know. And so sometimes my film... The film, the documentary, may not get into certain places because it addresses our community. Right. But wherever it gets to, the Lord seemed fit for it to, to win 11. Yeah. We won 11 wow. global awards this year. 11? Yeah. People in India, people in China, they want to hear about the African-American experience. Wow. So when they're looking at this film, they're seeing subject matter experts, doctors. You can't take away what was gained by that doctor, that therapist, that martial artist. When they have 
the credentials that the world wants from them, right. and they can get on to my documentary and speak from their subject matter expert, mm. no one can deny a black belt. Yeah. No one can deny when you are a psychologist and you have a license. Right. Nobody can deny when you are a therapist with right. a license. Yes, the problem, the problem exists that, Carlos, we make up such a small percentage. Mm. So as a physical therapist, we black physical therapists only make up about 2% of wow. the total of the therapy total therapists, yeah, in the country. So. Wow. You know, I mean, I'm like a unicorn. <laughs> that, that's a, a lo- that's a, alarming numbers, but at the same time, it 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 speaks to that we need more of yeah. of, of, of of our stories. And I commend you. And one thing you you you're doing is that you see the difference and the effect that you have in these children's lives. Yeah. You see the effect that your movie is making. So you 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 have a gauge system of knowing what you're doing and how it works. Yeah, you know, for I'm a martial artist, one of the things that I'm really excited about when you see this film is part one, right? Part one, you're gonna see kids from three years ago. Right. Do you got you got I know I know you got the I know you got yeah. some yeah, okay. So they're practicing, they're in their gi, that's me holding mitts and things like that, kicking bags and all that. But one of the things that's really important is in part two that's coming out next year. Nice. You know, we have I'm a martial artist too that's coming out. And it's going. You're going to see the kids in tournaments. Awesome. You're going to see them going up. The against, same kids that were in one. Yep. The oh, same kids. Man, that's and you're going to see them two years older. Wow. So you're going to see them growing up in D.C. What is it like that these kids go through in the city? But now look at them when they go up against kids that don't look like them. That they're going to national tournaments. Right. And they're competing. And they're competing at a, a different competing. level, yeah. Yes, yeah. and not with with handicapped children. They're competing with everybody else. Wow. wow. And so they come home wow. with trophies and medals and things like that. It just raises up their, their dignity. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, man. It, it, it's a good feeling. Can to you be imagine being picked on and then you learning this craft and learning the arts and then you're, you're competing with, with folks that, you know, it just I, I can imagine what it can do to a child. Yeah, uh, it, for oh, for yeah, a child yeah. and and for me, you know, yeah. just to see that these kids get it, yeah. and they're not afraid. Yeah. You know, when you can see that that fear goes away, yeah. you know, by by practice and promotion, and that's that's what we want. We want to be able to compete on a high level. Let's let them know that film again because you're going to be seeing two coming soon. Yes. Yep. I'm a martial artist. One. I'm a martial artist. One. It's being featured right now in uh, the Visions of a Black Experience out of Sarasota, Florida. It's in a film festival this weekend. Please go ahead and if you can find Visions of a uh, Black Experience, you'll see that um, it's it's being featured with a devil in a blue dress. You mm. know what I'm saying? Other wow. work, other wow. people's work, and in, in here. I'm a martial artist is running with others. Uh, it's, it was featured in Martha's Vineyard, uh, Black Film Festival. Yeah, man. man. Uh, just any way that uh, it could grow and be seen, that's where we want to place it. You know, we want to get it into other film festivals for people to learn about what's happening right here in the nation's capital. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. And uh, I commend you on that, uh, Jason. Uh, you, are, you are a community leader and you also are a creative uh, yeah. and uh, so we, we, we champion that here uh, thank you yeah, so uh, J- uh, Jason also uh, just had a screening <laughs> yes. yeah Jason had a screening at the theater that I grew up around I grew up around the Northeast 1228 Duncan Street. That's yeah. the theater. I, I was there, 8th Street, where that, the guy with the car with all the colors on it, the antennas back in the day, Holly Farms. I come yeah. from that 8th Street. Yes. And the Adelstead Theater is still there. Uh, I I don't, I don't. want to talk to you about um, uh, Home Health Chronicles. Home Health Chronicles. Um, let's, uh, let's tap on, let, let's touch on 
How was your event last week, bro? Uh, I, 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 once again, I apologize for not being there, but I was okay. there in spirit. For uh, sure. Uh, but let's talk about that. And who you had there? Uh, let's let's, man, let's just talk about. Let's talk about that. Yeah, let's talk. Uh, those who were there, man. It starts with family, man. Yeah. When your mom and dad. Ooh, like, man. Look, they came down from Philly. I had Carlos coming down. My friends, my family, my sister, my niece. Uh, you oh, know, loved wow. ones, everybody who was in the audience, it was just amazing. Awesome. Man. Wow. So I, I focus on who's in the house, not who wasn't in the house. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, That's right. Man, I had my I had my martial arts family there and man, just friends, people in the industry, people who are from who are uh, physical therapists, all kind of people that was and there. And the health, 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 yeah, exactly. Oh, my church family was there, you awesome. know what I'm saying? Congratulations. So, College Park Church of Christ, man, one time. Yes, sir. Brother That's Michael B. Fadden. Michael B. Fadden passed over there. Exactly, Shout man. Shout out to you, brother. I'm and keep um, this clean. Yeah, you know, it. but uh, more, more importantly, those who were in the house, man, were the cast and the crew. The cast and the crew showed up, man. They did an awesome job on the film. Everybody who was a part of this project, um, we we had uh, Kelly Williams. Kelly Williams from uh, two, what was that? Two, Family Matters. Family Matters. Family okay, Matters, okay. man. That's Urkel's. Wow. Uh, man, Urkel had a thing for her. Wow. How'd you work that out? <laughs> you got some connections. Yeah, yeah, pull. Man, yeah. yeah I had to pull some, <laughs> man. She, she is an amazing person. Down yeah. to earth. She's from the D.C. area. She, she got a new platform coming out. Awesome. And, um, it was just amazing talking to her, yeah. and I want to grow and I want to learn with her. Yeah. You know, um, body of evidence was in there. You know, body of evidence. Yeah, go go band. Yeah. yeah, man, man, Kurt and his group, man. I got a chance to meet them. They wow. bought it. They brought it. Wow. You get a chance to hear their uh, some of the go go music in my film. Yes. Uh, yeah. But it was a gospel go go song that was used in the song for a character that I wrote by the name of Go Go Gary. Mm -hmm. Kevin